Getting a new computer is as exciting as it comes, but getting it to run at peak performance requires a bit of tinkering and technological know-how. You can get the best hardware on the market right now. And yet if your operating system isn't properly calibrated, you won't be able to squeeze out those extra frames. In our video today, we're going to talk about 7 tips and tricks for Windows 11 that'll help you optimize your PC for video gaming. So, without further ado, let's begin. As an obsessive frame rate counter, the very first thing I always do when setting up a new Windows machine is enable game mode. This often overlooked setting is buried in the Windows settings under gaming. What game mode does is shift more of your computer's resources, CPU, RAM, GPU, to the actual game rather than all the background processes Windows normally runs. I cannot emphasize enough what a difference toggling on this one setting makes. By dedicating more juice to the game itself, you ensure higher, smoother frame rates. In my testing, I instantly gained an extra 10 to 15 FPS across some standard game benchmarks after flipping this switch. That's the difference between stuttering along at 40 FPS or buttery 60 FPS gameplay. So if you game on Windows, I cannot recommend enabling game mode enough. Out of all the tips here, it provides the single biggest boost by reallocating your hardware power to what matters most, silky smooth gaming performance. The custom profiles per game let you fine tune from there. It's an obsessive PC gamer's dream. Did you know that 72% of visitors are more likely to make their purchases soon after watching a product video? This makes it necessary to have a product demonstration or promo video for showcasing your product's potential values and benefits. At Product Video Studio, we are equipped with camera gear, tools, and most importantly, expertise to make your video captivating and engaging. Just send your products and we'll handle the rest. Contact us today to create something amazing together. Modern GPUs, like my NVIDIA RTX 3080, have specialized hardware schedulers on board that can directly prioritize and queue up graphics tasks for massively increased efficiency. But you need to enable this integration with Windows 11. Buried in the graphics settings under Gaming lies the magical toggle for hardware-accelerated GPU scheduling. By flipping this on, I hand direct control of my graphics card scheduling to itself rather than relying on CPU software management. This allows my GPU to rapidly assign resources to graphics tasks as needed without any middleman bottleneck. The results are astounding. Buttery smooth frame rates with overhead to spare in even the most demanding Tripe titles at max settings. We're talking about a solid 15 to 20 FPS uptick in games like Cyberpunk 2077 at 4K resolution with all ray tracing effects enabled. My frame rates now stick to 60 FPS instead of stuttering in the 40s thanks to proper scheduling delegation direct from GPU hardware to Windows 11. It works some serious magic. One of the most infamous settings that contribute to mouse lag in Windows is the so-called Enhanced Pointer Precision option buried in mouse properties. This legacy setting aims to provide ultra-precise pointer control through mouse acceleration curves and other software tricks. However, what I want as a competitive gamer is complete raw one-to-one -one mouse input, translated to on-screen movement. Any software meddling just gets in the way of aiming precision. So after disabling pointer precision, my mouse response became beautifully crisp and direct during fast swipes and target tracking. No more overshooting targets due to manipulated acceleration. My on-screen crosshair movement now perfectly correlates to my physical hand gestures. This brought my sniper rifle headshot rate to near perfection in games like Valorant. Tiny micro adjustments for flick shots translate flawlessly for quickscopes. Disabling pointer precision hugely tightened up my Twitch aiming game. Crisp, lag-free, one-to-one -one input response is essential for dominating ranked multiplayer shooters and removing enhanced pointer precision in Windows delivered exactly that. No more missed shots blamed on bad lag.
One of the most vital yet overlooked aspects of getting flawless gaming performance in Windows is staying diligently up to date with all your drivers and OS patches. Unlike consoles, PC games rely on an ecosystem of components and software that receive near constant upgrades behind the curtains. The latest graphics drivers for your GPU optimize and enhance how Windows leverages the hardware. Fresh Windows updates patch security issues while improving how the OS allocates resources. Even motherboard chipset firmware upgrades can fix compatibility issues and boost data throughput from storage devices. Too many gamers neglect the digital supply chain that makes PC gaming possible. Before playing any titles on my new Windows 11 rig, I force-fed it a feast of driver updates, Windows upgrades, and firmware patches. And the difference post-feast is night and day. My games have never run faster or smoother now that every component and API hums flawlessly together in sync. No hitches, hangs, tears, or crashes. So please, fellow gamers, never neglect your digital diet. Always update early and update often. It never fails. Computer makers love cramming new PCs full of helpful bloatware that inevitably gobbles up RAM, CPU cycles, and disk space. As soon as I fired up my new Windows 11 machine, I rapidly right-clicked and ruthlessly uninstalled all unnecessary background apps and services. Say goodbye to trialware, nuisance notifications, and preloaded solutions I'll never use. Removing this performance-sucking cruft freed up precious system resources now solely dedicated to gaming, not corporate garbage. My boots got faster, games loaded quicker, and frame rates jumped thanks to reclaimed memory and processing power. Out with the bloat, in with the glory. I still periodically purge any new unwanted apps that somehow sneak through. A clean Windows rig is a mean game-crushing machine. Gaming pushes PC hardware to the absolute limit, so you need a Windows power plan that stays out of the way. The default balanced plan artificially strangulates component speeds to increase battery life. No good. Instead, I use the ultimate high-performance plan that rips off the power shackles. Both my CPU and GPU can now sustain maximum clock speeds no matter how demanding the game. The results speak for themselves. Huge FPS gains, faster level loading, and world-class benchmark numbers across the board. My machine transformed from a tame clunker to an untamed powerhouse nearly overnight just by selecting the most aggressive Windows power policy possible. Want epic gaming performance? Unlock your hardware's true unrestricted muscle with high performance mode enabled. The key to extracting peak performance from a Windows gaming rig is recognizing that optimization is an ongoing process, not a one and done deal. As you install new games, graphics cards, RAM, and CPUs over time, revisit these tuning steps often. System requirements and hardware capabilities evolve across generations. New Windows updates roll out continuously as well. This means tweaking game mode settings, updating drivers, adjusting power plants, and decluttering startups for every major component change. Consider your rig a living, breathing competitive machine demanding this regular maintenance for maximum speed. But the effort pays off hugely via higher FPS, faster response times, and the ultimate bragging rights among fellow enthusiasts about your meticulously fine-tuned setup. So those were our Windows 11 tips and tricks to improve gaming performance. Do let us know if these tips helped you see an improvement in performance, as we'd love to hear from you.